Hey guys, Homestead Dad again. So I told you in one of the previous videos that I was going to make a box to go around the new pig trough I got. Let me show you what I'm talking about. <clears throat> so, on, I got this trough, it's actually a mixing tub at Tractor Supply. And what I'm going to do is build a frame of 2x6s to go around it so that the pigs can't dump it over. And then I'm going to put some 2x4s across it so that the pigs can't climb in there like they have been doing. So uh, let's see if we can get to that right now. Okay, so I've got the box built, and it's just going to support it. it uh, it's not keeping it off the ground or anything like that. Now I'm going to go ahead and measure and cut to put some 2x4s across the top. So here is the finished product. Now, they should still have plenty of room to get their heads in, in the different spots, but now they shouldn't be able to get their whole body in there. I mean, they could probably climb across, but it won't be comfortable. Um, if you've ever had pigs, you probably know they like to climb in everything. This is my first time having pigs, and man, like, I'll put out a tray of you know food or milk or whatever, and they're in it all of a sudden. So. Um, I can't remember, I saw another guy's video where he had bigger pigs, more production style pigs, but he created something similar to this, but much larger because his pigs could get over, you know, something bigger. The American guinea hogs aren't that big, so this I think is going to be perfect because it's not quite so um, high and they can get their head into it without having to climb into it. So uh, we'll see how it goes. So I used regular kiln dried lumber. Uh, because this is going to be their food, um, and I don't want there to be pressure-treated lumber all around where they're eating. So, um, eventually it'll rot and I'll need to build a new one, but I normally have enough scrap lumber around where it's not a huge deal. So, this is what I'm going to use. Um, once I get it out there, I will uh, show you guys how it works. Well, as you can tell from the video, I need to make a, a minor adjustment. Um, not having anything across the middle of it allows them to kind of step all the way in. I think if maybe I put one cross beam across the middle, it'll stop them.
It seems to be working. I think I'll probably flip the orientation so instead of being long ways this way, it goes that way. So they're not fighting for those three spots and back. But all three or all four pigs are able to eat the same trough without killing each other. As opposed to when I just put that in, like one of the big females would just sit in the trough and wouldn't let anybody else in. So it seems like it's gonna work. Um, I'll give you guys an update some point in the future, let you know if it's got problems, if it needs to be fixed, if it needs to be adjusted, or if it's good the way it is. So, um, but if you can look at the pigs, all four of them are eating. They're not squealing at each other and biting at each other. So I think it's pretty good. So we'll catch you guys in the next video. If you've liked anything you've seen, please consider giving that uh, like button a click or uh, the subscribe button. It really helps out the channel and I appreciate it greatly. Thanks. See you guys in the comments.